Hello guys, welcome back to AC1 Engineering YouTube channel. Please subscribe our channel for daily one engineering videos. Today our lecture is about the fluid mechanics. In this lecture, we are going to differentiate between the steady and the unsteady flow. The steady flow is the type of the flow in which the properties of the fluid is not changing with respect to the time. So, in this case, in this steady flow, the properties of the fluid is not dependent on the time. So, the properties of the fluid may be the discharge, the velocity of the fluid, or the viscosity of the fluid, or the pressure of the fluid. These are not dependent on the time. They are not function of the time. While in case of the unsteady flow, the properties of the fluid depends on time and it changes with the time. So, this was the steady flow. While for the unsteady flow, the properties of the fluid are changing with respect to the time. So, the flow in which the discharge, the velocity, the viscosity of the fluid, or the pressure of the fluid is changing with respect to the time, and they are dependent on the time, so we call such type of flow as the unsteady flow. Now, to explain in more detail, the, let's consider this discharge. So, the discharge of the fluid with respect to the time, the derivative of this discharge will be equal to zero. Similarly, the viscosity or the velocity with respect to the time will be zero. Also, the viscosity or the pressure with respect to the time will be zero. Because there is no change in these properties. The discharge or the velocity or the viscosity or the other properties of the fluid with respect to the time, there will be no change. So the derivative of these properties will be equal to zero. While in this case, the derivative of these quantities with respect to the time will not be equal to zero. The discharge of pressure, the, the uh, change in pressure with respect to the time will not be equal to zero. Why? Because we will have some change in the pressure with respect to the time in the fluid. That's why these properties is changing with the time. Now, let's consider this is any fluid, fluid passing through a pipe. This is any pipe, and we have fluid passing in this pipe. So, the fluid here is, in the case of the steady, in case of the steady flow, this fluid, let's suppose, has a velocity of 2 meter per second. Here, it, and we measure the time here is 5 seconds. Now, when this flow flow when this fluid flows and after some time let consider after one minute exactly so we have here 65 second so after one minute this fluid comes here and again we measure the velocity of the fluid it comes out to be two meter per second so the velocity is not changed with respect to the time. So we call such type of flow as the steady flow because we get the same velocity here at 5 seconds and here at 65 seconds we get the same velocity or the same, dis or the same discharge or the same viscosity of the fluid so here is a steady flow. While in case of the an unsteady flow if you consider this in a pipe and here is the fluid flowing in the pipe and this fluid, let's suppose at the 5 second, have a velocity of our velocity or the discharge, let's consider, of 5 cubic meter per second at one point at 5 second. And this fluid, let's suppose, move to the another point. And after one minute exactly, we have 65 second. And, and this fluid comes to another point here. And here we measure the discharge and it, this is a discharge, and here we measure again the discharge and it comes out to be, let it, let's take is 8 cubic meter, 8, 8 cubic meter per second. So, the discharge is changed with respect to the time. Here it was 5 second, 5 cubic meter per second, while here after 1 minute it becomes 8 cubic meter per second. So, this change in the property of the fluid is because of the type of the flow. 
So this unsteady flow, in case of the unsteady flow, our properties of the fluid should must be changed with respect to the time. While here, there is no change in the properties of the fluid with respect to the time. Hope you guys understand and don't forget to subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos. Thank you for watching our video.